So before Ryan went through the Hooves program, he was very isolated. You know, just having bursts of anger. I didn't know where they were coming from. He wouldn't make friends with people. I'd try to kind of plan stuff with friends. He would never do that. Basically just avoid everything. Avoid me, avoid our kids, avoid anyone. I would, you know, basically just shut myself off from them. I would come home from work. I'd go right to the den and wouldn't see them the rest of the night sometimes. I thought that solutions to, the, to my problems were at the bottom of a bottle. And it really became bad. It really got bad. I always felt like I was on eggshells. My kids felt like they were on eggshells. It was a very, very dark, difficult time in our lives. I was starting to see uh, me losing my wife, my kids, my whole family. Everything that meant something to me, I could start to see that it was starting to go away. I saw my kids shutting down, really shutting down. And I hit my rock bottom. In fact, I went further than that. I hit the sludge, uh, you know, to the point where I had a 40 cal in my mouth and I was ready to pull the trigger. At that point, she reached out. I told her, uh, which was a big step for me, I said, I need help. I don't care what it is, but I need to find some help. So I started doing a lot of research about PTSD because I didn't really know what it was. I knew there was something different, I just didn't know what. I found Hooves online and called Amanda and he says I duped him, but... Um, she said, hey, I set us up for this bed and breakfast. It's a couple hours away down in Ohio. Uh, you know, just a nice little weekend for us to get away. And I said, hey, great, sounds good. And we get here and she finally decides to tell me that, by the way, tomorrow I have you set up to play with some horses. I mean, I was pretty livid at that point. I'm like, okay, you tricked me, you got me. But I said, I'll, I'll do it because I love you. Well, it was a four hour intro session and come to find out I made more progress in those four hours than I did in the previous eight years of trying to, you know, find other avenues to, uh, you know, for help. It, it just began from there, and I got to that point where I, I started to see things differently already. And the transformation was already beginning to take place. I could gradually see the change in him as a person. He became engaged again. I didn't feel alone anymore. And I was just waiting for the next one. I, I, I couldn't wait for the next workshop and then the next workshop and the next one. And it got to the point where, wow, each time I was progressing and I was starting to really see real transformation. I was seeing him help himself, which was amazing because then he turned that around and helped me. And now we just want to help everyone we can.